Welcome back to the Sports News Analysis YouTube channel, where I'm always breaking down the hot sports topics of the day. My name is Mike. The Miami Dolphins making yet another free agent move on the offensive side of the ball today, acquiring wide receiver Brandon Gibson, formerly of the St. Louis Rams. Uh, Brandon Gibson comes over uh, last year, pretty productive season, 650 yards receiving uh, out of that slot position for the Rams. Uh, the the signing is a little bit puzzling for me from this standpoint. They give Gibson a three-year deal. They already have a pretty good slot receiver in Devon Bess. So was this move made to replace Bess or just to provide or just to give some more competition here uh, heading into camp for that spot? Uh, it makes me think since they gave Gibson a three-year contract that they have plans for the guy. So does this mean something for Bess? Will he be released? Will he, will he see his role be severely diminished by the Dolphins? Um, are they planning on using a lot of four wide attacks? Uh, they also got Dustin Keller a little bit earlier today, which I did a video on as well. Um, you know, so the Dolphins with this move are either trying to replace Devon Bess or trying to get some competition in there and add another a uh, quality uh, slot kind of receiver to their roster. Um, you know, we'll see the kind of sets they come out in, in this year. Uh, maybe they come out in more four wides where you know they would need Bess Gibson. Wallace, and of course, Brian Hartline. So it's been a busy offseason for the Dolphins, uh, you know, with the, with the signing of all these offensive players, with Danell Ellerby on the defensive side. It remains to be seen what happens with a free agent left tackle, Jake Long. And if they don't sign him, you know, how do they address that left tackle spot? Do they address it in the draft? Do they address it in free agency? Still remains to be seen. The draft is pretty deep uh, in the tackle spot. So we'll see what happens there. But for now, another solid signing. Brandon Gibson's a, a solid pro. Uh, I think you know if Tanny Hill can mature here, they could potentially this year or definitely you know in two years have a heck of an offense uh, down there in Miami. Uh, let me know what you think of the signing of Brandon Gibson. Hit me up in the YouTube comments. Hit me up on Twitter at S News Analysis. And guys, be sure to subscribe to my channel uh, to get all of my uh, sports talk videos uploaded directly to your feed here on YouTube. Thanks again for listening and have a great night.